Hey guys, welcome back to the Starkville YouTube channel. I finally got the Harbor Freight coupon catalog, the red tag sale here for this month. Uh, normally I get it a week before the month starts, and this time I got it a week after. So, uh, the bastards were late. Here you see the Inside Track Club coupons, and check out the back of this thing. Wah, wah. What the hell? So, again, as we learned about a month or two ago, the Inside Track Club coupons are 1231 they expire this catalog was the expiration date is 131 so they last a month longer in the regular catalog that everyone gets so if you're an inside track club member i would definitely suggest you also sign up for um just a regular non inside track club member thing like just use a different uh name or a different account or whatever something that's not inside track club members so you get both of them because we also learned a bunch of people were pointing out price differences in the coupons is even though it's the same items for sale in this coupon catalog in this one uh, the prices are actually higher in the inside track club coupon so um, why you're paying for the membership and then getting shittier stuff I have no idea but make sure you're getting both so we're going to go through that as I said it's good till January 31st so it's good for two months we'll leave it up for a little bit I also put scans of the coupons in this on my website. There will be a link down below for that. Before we get into this, I want to show you guys something I picked up at a thrift store the other day because it was a really good deal. I'm happy about it. At least I think it was a really good deal. It really seems like it's a good deal, but I haven't tested it yet. So, bam. I got this Master Force 18-volt lithium-ion uh, half-inch drive impact. Master Force is a Menards brand if you are unfamiliar with it. This must be an older model. I saw they have a 20 volt out for sale right now, but here you can look up. That's the Menard SKU number, and nothing comes up on their website. So I paid $11.99 for the 18 volt battery here, battery two, and the charger. I've been able to charge both batteries, so that was pretty cool. Also, got a little battery indicator thing there. So really excited. give this thing a try and really as far as I'm concerned if it'll take my tires off without me having to get out my air compressor and air it up and all that shit then uh, that's success for me so there we go eleven ninety nine. I actually saw the 20 volt one which I don't know if it's the same brand but I don't know how otherwise uh, identical it is but the 20 volt one on Menard's website is going for like $379 I don't plan on selling this. I'll probably keep it for myself, but um, I'm sure it's not worth that much, especially because it's also used and it's the 18 volt, but still happy with that purchase. Okay, so on to the coupons for this month. And again, I know it might be hard to read the codes on the coupons here, so uh, I do have the scans on my website. Well, I don't as the time of this recording, but by the time you guys watch this, I will hopefully have it done. Maybe if we're all nice to Monica, she'll scan them for me. Right, Monica? That's right. She said that's right. If, uh, you didn't hear. I kind of like this wood table, but I don't think it's a very popular item for Harbor Freight. What uh, a lot of you guys might not know is years and years ago, before I had my website and before I was posting free coupons, I worked at a hotel and I'd get like 20 newspapers every week and the newspapers always have Harbor Freight coupons. So since I had free time, I would cut out all the Harbor Freight coupons and use like a football card holder to hold all the coupons and I'd list them for sale on eBay. I can't remember how much I charged for them now. It was either like, I think it was like $1.49. And then they would just ship in a envelope with a stamp. So I think I ended up making like 75 cents off each one. It wasn't a whole lot, but it was something I could do at work to pass the time. Anyways, I would sell tons of these. I was selling enough coupons to where my account at the time for eBay was classified as a high volume seller because so many coupons were selling. That was the only thing that I had listed. Anyways. To make a short story long, that wood uh, table has always had a coupon available. That coupon's been out forever. 
and it was one of them that I would sell or I would list and it would never sell. So just kind of judging by how often certain coupons could sell, I could kind of tell what items just felt like they were more popular at Harbor Freight and which were less popular. And I'll tell you, the um, the Jacks, the low profile, what is it, one and a half or two ton or whatever the hell it is, Jack, sold a ton. The um, Torque Wrenches did really well and the Generator. Oh, here it is up here, but it wasn't called this Gator thing back then. It was a blue one, and I forgot the brand, but the same size. So just a little tidbit for you guys. So here's Harbor Freight's impact. It sells for two thirty nine. Is that twenty volts or what is that? Where does it say? Where does it say? Well, I don't know what it is, but. I made a bad deal on these damn things. I bought a bunch of these uh, saw blades because at the time I thought it was a good uh, retail arbitrage thing, something to buy at Harbor Freight then resell on Amazon. And that hasn't worked out. They didn't sell. I should know better. Everyone's paying the same thing for Harbor Freight, so it's really hard to get any good retail arbitrage deal. Um, I've only had a few items. From Harbor Freight that I've ever been able to sell and actually make any kind of real profit from. Magnetic tool holder is an awesome free item so don't pay the $3.99. Go to my website struggleville.net get it for free. I don't know if I talked about it in a video or not, but I finally did pick up this jack. Oh, I did do a video of me going to buy it. Well, I'll be damned. See, that's how good my memory is. So far, so good. I've only used it twice, but no problem, so happy with that. Truck bed gas powered air compressor. Why does that look new? I don't remember that. Cool little tool set for Coupons for these moving blankets aren't as good as they used to be. At one time it was like uh, $3.99 with a coupon. Did I skip a page? Nope. Alright, we're good. breeze through the non-coupon sales stuff and just see what we got. And they're coming out with so much stuff under these new brand names. The Bauer and Hercules and whatever the hell else they had. But there's a ton of stuff they're coming out with these now. Get a coupon there. Beats DeWalt. I'm not sure about that.
Jesus Christ, look how many nail guns they have. So many variations. Here's the same jack that there was a coupon for earlier. It's funny how they'll do that in the catalog too. I hate when they sneak like one coupon on a page because I'm going to have to go back and scan that just for one little coupon. Fifteen bonus coupons. Twenty percent off loading ramps. Some of these are new coupons that I just don't remember before. Tailgater uh, generator again. And the chipper shredder was in there before. That's a coupon. damn spray gun. That thing sucks.
funny, this catalog's like 50 pages long. It's like everything in the store. I wonder how much money they spend just in printing catalogs and sending them to people. Hell, I get three catalogs. So that magnetic tool holder again. Every day we beat the home centers, hardware, and auto parts stores on quality and price. Right, guys here we are at the end 20% off a couple of free things Another page of coupons all right guys that is it thanks for watching and I will see you next time